and the plant based bundle is happening right now. This is your chance to get uh, 110 plus ebooks and courses worth 4,000 US dollars for only 50 US dollars. Check out the link in the description um, to get it. And also remember, this is my unique link. So if you use my link, I will give you extra bonuses as well. Um, I will be sending you um, a raw vegan bunny course. <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> How did this happen? Raw Vegan Bunny course, um, 27 videos on how to make bread, cheeses, uh, burger, tacos, um, and also soup stews. Um, and also I'll do a live Zoom group call for all of you. So just email me your order ID uh, or your receipt if you get the bundle using my link and um, I'll email that across to you. Okay, so today I wanted to try out a recipe from the ebook, the Ultimate Tofu Cookbook. Yeah, this is by the Vegan Punks. Yeah, I'll show you a little bit more, but um, maybe I will. Yeah, let's start in the recipe first because um, some parts take like ten minutes. Is it? Yeah. Okay. So let me see. They may help me to you the ingredients. So the ingredients they ask for 400 grams extra firm tofu cut into 2 cm chunks, 2 teaspoons curry powder, then for the sauce is 1 cup of water, 230 grams baby spinach, uh, 1 large onion, 3 cloves garlic, 1 teaspoon chili flakes, I have chili flakes, um, 1 3 teaspoons garam masala, I have garam masala, uh, 2 teaspoons coriander, is oh coriander and three teaspoons ground cumin which is actually just like you know one tablespoon and two teaspoons curry powder so curry powder and half cup tomato puree I I had cherry tomatoes I just blended them um, And then uh, 400 ml coconut milk, that's the coconut milk, and then salt to taste. Okay, so initially they ask you to put the tofu in a large bowl, add 2 teaspoons of curry powder and then give it a good stir until all of the tofu pieces are coated. Um, and then they ask you to put it into a frying pan, but I didn't want to do that. So basically I cut up the tofu and then I coated it with more than 2 teaspoons of curry powder and I put it into the dehydrator and dehydrated it first. Because I didn't want to put it in a pan. I can't really put it in here because it'll break up anyway. Um, okay. Uh, let me see. Yeah. So now it says put some of the spinach along with the water into a blender and then blend. Keep adding handfuls of spinach until the mixture is smooth. Okay, so let's do that. Um, it asks for baby spinach but I actually just use like baby bayam or bayam that I got from my local farmer. And because I got it much earlier, I had to freeze it. So yeah, it's frozen. So um, I'm gonna use I'm gonna do this in my thermal mix. Ah. Maybe I should cut it just now, haha. <laughs> Instead of trying to use my hands to crush it. I don't know. I think I put everything in. I think we can process everything. Yay. What happened to my spatula? Ah, there you go. Yeah. Ah, okay, I'll just let you know. Um I owe my course Mexican Fiesta is also inside this bundle. Um the bundle happens from 
only for 10 days but I think there's only 4 more days left it is yeah there's only 4 more days left it ends on July 14 at uh, midnight EST so remember it's EST and not PST because most bundles end at PST but this bundle ends at EST um my course Mexican Fiesta is a raw vegan course, it's oil free. Yeah. You learn how to make nachos, tacos, quesadillas, uh, purple tortilla chips, lacto fermented jalapenos. Yeah, I need to do it. Huh, I should, I need to put my 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 ebook back onto my onto my new iPad because yeah I think I don't have it on my iPad do a bit more spinach here yeah how's everybody doing today yeah I managed to go for my do my chikung today because it wasn't raining yesterday it was like raining the whole morning so I couldn't do it I did my hand exercises oh the thermomix wants to turn off no. super sleepy today I don't know why by 2.45 I was like I'm so sleepy oh because I woke up at 5 today no I woke up at 5 then 5? 5 ish? yeah I think that's why okay I'm gonna blend this Get this blender, and then after blending, I still need to put it in the container. Mm. So I'm still gonna blend it until it's smooth. Yeah, if you want a raw vegan version, uh, I should make a raw vegan version on YouTube. Chris Candle's recipe. You can go hunt for that. It's looking nice and good. I'll show you. Yeah. She's looking really good. <coughs> this is how it looks like right now. And, uh, yeah. Okay. Try to figure out like where to put it. I see like whether I can just not have to open wash another another container. <laughs> so okay, let me scrape all this down first. I think I put it on this plate. Hopefully it won't like melt too much or something. I remember I, I used to always have palak paneer uh whenever I had Indian food. This was um, obviously before I was vegan. I don't think I have had palak paneer after I became vegan. I'm not sure. I guess not. But there was one place. No, no, no. That wasn't the spinach one. That was, um, I think like some other thing. Lah. The, the worker there said it was paneer. Uh, yeah. Paneer, but the the boss said, "Oh no, that is actually just tofu." So we had that. <gasps> uh, okay. <laughs> I'm getting things being spilled and all that. Hold on, let me do this over here so you can actually see what's going on. I forgot to turn on the lights. Okay. It's better. 
Okay, anyway, let me, um, this is kind of in the way. Okay, let's see if I can do this. I'm basically trying to, yeah, I'm trying to, um, not have to wash too many things. Because it, it says in a blender, but I didn't want to like do this separately in the, 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 the Vitamix because it would mean I have to wash the Vitamix as well. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, yeah, large pan over medium heat, add splash of oil, then add onion and cook until translucent. And the onion is supposed to be chopped. So, let me get the Vitamix to do the chopping for me. Where's the onion? Okay, you can see it better this way. Uh, let's chop. So I'm just scraping down the onions now. Gonna put in some water. translucent okay I'm just gonna cook this for like two three minutes yeah so put this to a hundred let it cook okay so that it's cooking and then let me show you this evil. Okay. All right. So let's start from the very beginning. This is the ultimate tofu cookbook. Um. So it's by Jess and Dan Saunders. Yeah, they have been doing a lot of research on making tofu. This day, um, at one point I know they traveled to Bali and learned a lot of, and Thailand and learned a lot of, um, they've been blogging for seven years. Yeah, they've learned a lot of, uh, techniques on how to make Asian food. Their yeah, Instagram content reaches up to three million people. Wow. Okay. All right. So tofu terminology. <laughs> Yeah, so there's firmness, super firm, extra firm, and firm. Yeah. Okay, and then um, medium silken soft. Yeah, and then they talk about pressing. It's strange though. I think in Malaysia, I don't see people pressing both. So, yeah. Ah, and then there's curries. Ooh. Tofu butter chicken. Ooh. Tofu katsu curry. Ah, this is the palak paneer. Yeah. Ah, palak tofu, sorry. Yeah. And this one is... Oh, tofu guna. Okay, interesting. Oh, I should try making that. Huh? And let's stir fry. Tofu mee goreng. Yeah, um, this one is sticky Sichuan tofu. Ooh. Now I feel like, oh, I should make that as well, haha. <laughs> and this one is fried rice, right? Eh, 
Vegan egg fried rice, yeah, correct. This one. Oh, sweet and sour. Yeah. And tofu chop suey. <laughs> Classic American Chinese dish. Ooh. It's the black. Ah, uh, black bean tofu. And this one is sticky pineapple tofu. Oh, how interesting. Oh. And a quick bites. Okay. Let's continue this. I hope I saved the... I did. Okay. So now it says throwing garlic and spices. Okay. So garlic. Okay, that's a garlic. And then we'll put in the spices. Okay. One teaspoon chili flakes. I think actually like in proper recipe writing, they ask you to put the most, the largest quantity first, I believe. I don't know, I need to go and check. Okay, one teaspoon chili flakes. Yeah, so there is some interesting things in the plant-based bundle, such as the um, course by Jillian Berry. If you want to go raw vegan, yeah, I can do raw vegan courses. Maybe three. Yeah, uh, three tablespoons garam masala. No, three teaspoons, sorry. Which is actually one tablespoon. So they should have written there one tablespoon. But we're using teaspoons anyway because we don't wanna. Okay. Ooh, it's smelling good. Smelling good. Three, uh, two teaspoons of ground cumin. Cumin. Three. Oh, okay. One, two, three. And then two teaspoons ground coriander. Coriander. Ah. One. You know, some are coming out at the side, so I'm not putting it full. Two. Okay. Alright. And then... Two teaspoon curry powder. Oh, I forgot to bloom it earlier. We should bloom all the... All of it, right? Oh, well, I forgot, so... So much spices, I love this. All right, and then uh, cook for another couple of minutes until fragrant. Okay. Hmm, I'm wondering about the. I think it's okay. There is still water here. Yeah. I should put in some of this. This is just water from the spinach because I froze it, so there's water coming out.
Okay, I think this is good enough. Alright. Okay, so we're gonna cook this for three minutes, two, three minutes. Alright. So let me show this to you. What else? Um, this is not what we'll be looking at. Oh, we haven't looked at the quick bites yet, I think. So these are the tofu chicken nuggets. And these are the quesadillas. Yeah, tofu and mushroom quesadilla. Uh, these tacos, right? Grated tofu tacos. You know, the tofu fries. Air fried tofu paprika fries. Oh, cool. Nice! Tofu BLT. Ah! Nice. And then there are bowls. Braised gochujang tofu. Yeah, I should have made this. But I think it's hard to braise anything inside there. Yeah, tteokbogi with smoked tofu. Ooh, this looks Mexican. Tofu quinoa bowl. Oh, right. Mexican inspired baked tofu quinoa bowl. See, I told you it looked Mexican. That's a pasta. Tofu curry pasta. It shouldn't work, but it really does. Apologies to both India and Italy. So cute. This is a noodle dish. Yeah, it's a noodle soup. Oh, tantan ramen. Oh, interesting. So they use tahini, soy sauce, rice, vinegar, chili oil, and brown miso paste. Ah, and then they have a chapter on the silken tofu. Ah, nice. So they made a carbonara out of it. Oh, they use a, a scrambled egg. Oh, I never know how to pronounce this. Can somebody teach me how to pronounce this? Okay, yeah, I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Um, this is a egg sandwich, egg mayo, yeah. I haven't tried this before, I should try this one day. Oh, this is mapo tofu, yeah. And pancakes, oh silicon tofu pancakes, how cool. It still uses flour though. Ooh, this one is a vegan Chinese curry. Chinese takeaway! Dehydrated tofu. Okay. Alright, so let's see what we need to do next. Try guy, point the spinach mix. Okay. Oh, I hope it's not too crazy. Okay, spinach mix. Okay, this is a bad idea to put it on a plate. I knew it was gonna be a bad idea, but so I really need to put it in a like a bowl or a taller container, but I was just like, that means I have to wash another one. And now I'm like spilling everything everywhere and then inside's not gonna be clean so that's not good. Okay, hold on. Let me see if the inside is... Oh, okay, we didn't really dirty anything, thank god. Because if not, it'll be hard to clean. Okay, good. Make it like too hot though. 
with the spices. Anyway, if I did, then it's a bit too late. <laughs> okay. Um. All right, coconut milk. I just used the coconut milk that I made from the. Um, ooh, is it too much water? Might be too much water. Hmm. And then add the tomato puree. Uh, point a minute. Spinach makes coconut milk. Tomato puree and tofu season well with salt healed for 10 minutes until it's all nice and hot. Because I'm wondering, like, is it going to be too liquid? Yeah. Because that was a lot of water from the. Oh well. Never mind. Because. I don't know what am I going to do with the coconut milk anyway. Okay. And then you also ask to put in the tofu. So hopefully the tofu is just at the top and doesn't like drop to the bottom and break. I hope. I almost want to put the tofu in like at five minute mark or three minute mark or something like that. Yeah. I'm just gonna put it like on top and hope that it will just not crumble. If not we just have like some mashed tomato. Some mashed tofu thing. <laughs> okay, so they said ten minutes. Okay, hold on. Let me get a stand because if we're gonna wait for 10 minutes, are we gonna wait for 10 minutes? I guess so. You no, know, you can't, can't see how it looks like. And I want to show you the other things in the promise bundle as well. So, hmm, hold on. Let me turn there. Let's see. Okay, so we're back to the palak tofu, but um, where were we? We were, oh, we are at dehydrated tofu and we were at the tofu bacon bits. Alright, so, yeah, dehydrated tofu. Interesting. Smoked tofu. Okay. Dehydrated and rehydrated tofu. Chopped tofu, Ruben. Oh, okay. Chopped tofu, Fili cheesesteak. Ah. Okay. Ooh. Sloppy Joe's. Interesting. Yeah. Okay, so that's the tofu book. I just want to see what it says about dehydrated tofu. I'm not so much a plate of food person. Uh, uh, nothing, it doesn't 
didn't say anything. Okay, you get your eyes there. Firmness. Hmm. Okay. Anyway. Ah, I wanted to show you the plant-based bundle. Um, this is the plant-based bundle where you get 110 ebooks, courses, and programs, including my course Mexican Fiesta. So with the bundle is 50 US dollars. Without the bundle is 4055.76. There's something for everyone. There's like healthy recipes, self wellness, workouts and mobility, juice and smoothie recipes. Is that, oh, let me try to make this more centered. Yeah, so it's a 99% discount right now, but only um, until 14 of July. So there's only like four days left to get it. You know, um, oh, this ebook is really good. The basics of bread. There's also, yeah. Anybody here fans of Madeline Olivia? There's also, she also has an ebook called Versatile Vegan and Plant Kitchen Comforts. I'll try and make a recipe from here tomorrow. I said that I don't have coconut milk, so hmm. A live lunch, 14 day vegan challenge, 6 weeks rather apps. So this is the tofu cookbook. So that is Dan and Jess. Jess. Yeah, Tales from the Tailgate. So does anybody have... Ah, that's my course, Mexican Fiesta, Soul Food Fans. Uh, I'm also going to try and make a recipe from this one. Yeah, and then I've made that. It's actually a pizza recipe in this one. That's really cool. Yeah, and then it's Juicing, Blooming Raw, and Cookbook. That's a really good one. There's things on fitness. There's juice recipes. Let's eat. There's raw vegan tacos. If you want to uh, bake, there's things on baking. Um, nourishing Amy has 30 nourishing vegan recipes. Uh, Plant Collective, Eat the Rainbow. I think this one is her new ebook, if I'm not mistaken. Make It Raw Volume 3, that's Wholesome Scoops. There's a Microgreens course. This, I like this book a lot, the other three favorites. I think I've made at least three from here. Kitchen Essentials course, Food Moon Banner, Pretty in Pink. This one also is really good, the 4 week plant reset meal plan. Yeah, this one's also very good, the 5 star salad revolution. And then, um, this is an interesting peanut butter and jelly beans. <laughs> yeah. There's a whole book on chickpeas as well for those who love chickpeas. Juicing, smoothie bowls. This one's also interesting because it's raw vegan three course dinner recipes. Yeah. And then it's fitness and shredded, plant based muscle, chakra expansion, body bliss, vegan dancing queen's kitchen, taste the kindness. This one, um, Alana, um, I have been on her Instagram. She's a naturopath, yeah, and she has three triplets, I think. <laughs> and uh, this one actually has a coloring book inside as well, so that's quite cool. Beyond My Food Eating, the sauce book if you want to make raw vegan sauces. Also, if you want to do batch cooking. Uh, this one is also really nice, the Raw Delicious for Kids book. And then this one, Brits, Spreads and Smiles, is also very good. If you want to lose weight, that's the effortless weight loss plan. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, raw vegan excuses. I should show you guys this one. I think, yeah. Oh, there's the vegan sushi at home. I should really show you this. The smoothie ebo deck that I showed you already. And then mucusless healing system. Some people have asked me about this before as well. There's also the raw vegan course by Jillian. Yeah. Ah, this one's also really nice. The flavors from Thailand. And then there's a master class to reduce overwhelm. There's a mindfulness and food workshop. There's a six week radiant challenge. Ooh, I need to download more stuff because more things have come in for this one. And then there's a plant based master class by Simple Green Smoothies. When I first started going raw, I followed them a lot and made a lot of these smoothies. There's a weight loss workshop. Strong is sexy workout plan. Um, ah, and there's a vegan protein powder. 
Okay, um, I wanted to show you guys something. What did I want to show you? Just oh, I think I wanted to show you the vegan sushi at home. Yeah, so let me get that. Ah, oh, there you go. Okay, so that's cheap, lazy, vegan. Prepared sushi rice, vegan flaky salmon. I'm trying to figure out like what. Yeah, so you guys can see the table contents. Oh, let me let me get a. Let me get something. Yeah, let me get a little um, hold on. even more there's nigiri and other sushi crispy sushi sauces other recipes from my blog yeah so yeah that's um rose she has a basic screwed up sushi rice vegan flaky salmon avocado and bean tomato tuna roasted bell pepper sashimi vegan spam smoked tofu strips chickpea tuna salad creamy tofu scallop she has a lot of recipes in this ebook crispy broccoli seared king oyster mushrooms Crabless cakes, there's also the vegan tempura, tempura dipping sauce, enoki mushroom tempura, sweet potato yam tempura, mixed vegetable tempura, smoked tofu tempura, and there's the rolls, seaweed on the outside rolls, and then she gives you instructions. And then there's a the teriyaki salmon roll, teriyaki tempeh roll, sweet chili smoked tofu roll, crispy broccoli roll, yam tempura roll. I like how hers is like very authentic crabless. I mean, it, it looks like all the the sushi recipes I will see in the sushi restaurants here in Malaysia. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay, let me bring you guys back over here. It does look like a palak paneer kind of thing. I want to pour it out, but if I pour it out, it might not. Oh, you know what? I should taste it first. I didn't salt it at all. I should. Although I am eating from this one that actually has the... Oh, it's nice. I guess I should salt it. 
Hold on, let me get. Hmm, my sauce I use. This was a salt given to me during a long time ago. Let me pour this out, but let me taste it again. Oh yeah, I need to finish eating this first. So this is more for Mr. Jazz guitarist, but I do need to taste it, so... Mm. It's interesting because this one doesn't have dairy, so it doesn't feel Because usually the ones at the restaurant feel because it does. Yeah, I was worried. Things will start splashing. Hmm. It will spoil my photos, but never mind. It's going to be a big portion. I don't know what I'm going to do with such huge portions. Okay. Okay. There you go. This is your power tofu. Yeah. Alright, does anybody have any questions? If not, um, check out the plant-based bundle. It's only happening until 14th of July, so there's only four more days left. Um, if you are into, um, I think if you like, like raw food, if you like tofu, um, if you like to make bread, if you want to get onto some of the fitness programs, um, if you want to take my course, the Mexican Fiesta course, then I think it's worth getting it. You know, yeah, because it's um, it's definitely worth the fifty US dollars. Yeah. So remember, use if you use my link to get the bundle, then you also qualify for extra bonuses as well. Email me your order ID, and I'll send across to you the uh, raw vegan by me course, the twenty seven extra videos, as well as um, later I'll email you the link to the. Uh, live group zoom call okay all right thanks so much for watching i'll see you another time if you're watching the replay um please leave your questions below also remember to like <laughs> and subscribe and uh, share this video <laughs> bye